Hi. If you're trying to decide whether or not to sell your house, recent headlines about home prices may be your focus. If those stories have you wondering what that means for your home's value, I'm going to tell you what you really need to know. Don't forget to like and subscribe to get more market video updates. New stories are mentioning a drop in homes value, but it's important to remember those headlines are designed to make a big impression in just a few words. But what headlines aren't always great at is painting the full picture. While prices are down slightly month over month in some markets, it's also true that home values are up nationally on a year over year basis. It's true that home price growth has slowed in recent months as buyer demand is pulled back due to higher mortgage rates. But this is what the headlines are drawing attention to today. But what's important to notice is the bigger, longer term picture. While home price growth is moderating, the percent of appreciation is still well above home price change we saw during more normal years in the market. January of 2019 through the mid-2020s had home price appreciation around 3 to 4 percent a year, but the latest data for this year shows prices have still climbed by roughly 10 percent over last year. So while you may not be able to capitalize on the 20 percent appreciation from 2022, your home's value on average is up 10 percent over last year. The big takeaway is don't let the headlines get in the way of your plans to sell. Over the past two years alone, you've likely gained a substantial amount of equity in your home as prices climbed. Even though home prices vary by market, you can still use the boost your equity got to help power your move. I'm Melissa Waterwall, real estate advisor, and I'm here to help with all things real estate. If you have questions about home prices or how much equity you have in your home, let's connect so you can get expert advice. See you next time.